5.7 magnitude earthquake hit Salt Lake City area and Irvine residents. About 73,000 homes and businesses lost electricity in the Last Lake City area. Rocky Mountain Power said, but power was being quickly restored in some areas. Some people run from their homes and into the street. Add sheets fell from shelves and picture from walls. Operations at Salt Lake City International Airport stopped and the control tower and concourses were evacuated, the airport tweeted. The airport was expected to reopen later Wednesday. The quack also shut down the light rail service for South Lake City and its suburbs. The earthquake hit a little after 7 a.m. local time. An estimated 2 million people likely felt the quake. The USA Geological Survey reported most residents felt their homes shaking for 10 to 15 seconds. It was the largest earthquake in Utah since a 5.9 magnitude quake hit the state in 1992, Utah Emergency Management said. The U.S. Geological Survey said that in general, magnitude 5 or larger earthquakes occur at an average rate of about one every 10 years in this area. Magnitude 6 or larger earthquakes occur about every 50 years in this area. Jordan, Utah told USA Today via text that the hospital was rocking. Men or men as if being born in a pandemic wasn't enough, men that was never rattling.